And now the first alert weather, a red flag warning just issued for parts of Northern California. Yeah, this is the earliest ever springtime red flag warning, but is Cal Fire ready for it? CBS 13's Laura Hayfley is in Auburn getting answers for us. Laura. Well, we know how devastating the fires were in the Tahoe area last summer. We knew firefighting agencies were going to be on high alert, but this is a perfect example of that. The National Weather Service issuing the earliest red flag warning to date, and that is for a number of reasons. First of all, we know we didn't see a lot of precipitation in the form of rain or snow in this area, so that means a lot of dry brush, whether it's in the forests or canyons like the one you see behind me here. It's places like that that are ripe for burning. The second issue this weekend that Cal Fire has uh, just talked to us about a moment ago is the fact that they're expecting extremely high winds, which means if any kind of spark ignites and that ember travels a distance, it can easily start a fire, which could pick up very quickly and spread very fast. Something obviously Cal Fire would like to avoid as well as the uh, forest service. So here's how you do that. Basically, this weekend is a no burn weekend. That is uh, information we just got from Cal Fire a moment ago. This weekend will be a no burn weekend in our area, which means no open flames. And of course, be cautious uh, with anything that you are doing outside that may or may not spark a fire, something, of course, you want to be uh, careful with. So now let's just talk about staffing for a second. Cal Fire does have a normal amount of staffing levels currently, but that extra seasonal bump they get, they're not going to get that until Monday, until after this red flag warning is over. So until then, CAL FIRE and other firefighting agencies, they're really counting on all of us to do our part to make sure that we're not sparking any potential fires. Very important advice. All right, thanks very much, Laura.